Okay, um, this is the Duck Cycler and I'm just going to quickly give a demonstration of my new gravel bike, which is I think the best budget gravel bike you can get for the money. And uh, it just works fine on um, the, the gravel road, right? Absolutely fine. I got so many gear selections here, I can go uh, you know, as up, I can go as easily as I want. It just rode absolutely fine. I've all, you know, I, when I bought the uh, this bicycle, I always wanted to get a mountain bike. Um, a mountain bike, right? Because I was always used to the uh, the flat handlebars. But I think these uh, these kind of gravel bikes with the drop down handlebars are the best. Um, just changing gears there. I'm um, just hard to kind of ride with them. Um, with uh, I'm getting used to riding it with one hand, right? But but the thing is, you can just take it on gravel. It just works absolutely fine. It's a very enjoyable too. I think it's enjoyable because of the steel frame, right? Uh, because it's got a steel frame, it's very enjoyable. Uh, so yeah, man, the Marini Casio is absolutely fine for. The gravel. Here we go. Here we go. I think the recording's back on. So yeah, absolutely. No problems at all riding on dirt and gravel on this. is pretty comfortable. Because of the seating position on these drop-down road bikes uh, is much more easy to pedal than mountain bikes, I feel. And also they're lighter. The road bikes in general are lighter than uh mountain bikes right so you know if you have a steel frame i don't i think you can get away with not needing all those suspensions or mountain unless you're really doing hardcore off trails right but these kind of gravel roads is i have no problems riding and in fact i'm kind of enjoying this it's it's enjoyable because the steel frame absorbs all the shocks so anyway i think this is uh like i said one of the best value gravel bikes you can get because if you want to get a gravel bike from one of the other brands like Trex or or Specialized, you know, you're looking at 1200 plus, 1500 plus at a minimum. And the beauty about this is I got a 30 mil uh, road uh, tire on right now, right? And I can take it up to 40 mils if I want to. And the 30 mil gives me good benefit of um, road performance and also it's quite sufficient here off-road as well just absolutely fine yeah put this video because um i wanted to get a bike someone had asked you know one of the i think one of the surprises that asked well, how does it handle off-road i think it handles just fine steel frame nice big ties plenty of width excellent gearing easy to ride Okay, stay tuned for more. This is a duck cycler cycling, uh, signing off. We'll catch up soon. Cheers. And do like and subscribe if, you, if you're enjoying these rides. Like I said, I'm a beginner rider. I'm no expert, so I don't have all the fancy gears. I just have a budget bike, which I'm trying to make the most of to get fit. Uh, I'm just trying to enjoy the spirit of cycling, right? So, yeah, just support me if you can. And I'll try to keep bringing some more videos. And, uh, you know, like and subscribe if you can. Cheers. Have a good day.